Sarah Cycle 4. Location, Sector Pole Orbital Dockyards, Corbinus Ward. Report log, 8463. Reporting officer, Luminary Second Class, Leandra Pace, 86 Grask, Illuminators. Report commences. Throne, but there's a lot of them coming through at the moment. Four more pilgrim ships in the last three days, as if we didn't have enough on our hands with the 18 currently docked. 18. You see the fear in every face. It's the thing, the hole in space, the rift or whatever they're calling it. The cowlheads will have some fancy high gothic name for it, but the rift will do for grunts like us. Whatever you call it, that's what they're fleeing, as though somehow you could run away from a void strangeness that stretches, well, from here to eternity's bloody gates as far as I can see. Idiots. Cowards. Faith in the Emperor isn't a place. It isn't words said or indulgences paid into offering pots. It's what's in your heart. You either have the faith or you don't, and only them that has it are going to survive. Folk like the Illuminators. We've got faith enough for all of them, and the Emperor sees it. Still, they might be idiots, but they're idiots with credit. The coffers won't be dry for a while. That much is for sure. Anyway, long shift, and few enough hours before I've got to do it all again, so... Report ends. Entry date. Talagas Standard. I-9458-01 Cycle 1. Location. Satrapol Orbital Duckyards. Corbinus Ward. Report log. 8468. Reporting Officer. Luminary Second Class Leandra Pace. 86 Gradesk Illuminators. Report commences. Violence today. An altercation in the penitence halls between a queue of pilgrims and the cult of the Emperor's anguish. Far as I can understand it, before we got there, the cultists had stirred up trouble by haranguing the new arrivals. They were griefing the newcomers over what they call body sin, how none of them bore the marks of purity, and how they should all fall to their knees and repent because the pilgrims carried seeds of annihilation in their hearts. A load of pseudo-heretical fear-mongering. The Emperor's anguish have been a pain in the arse for months now, harassing us, harassing the pilgrims, sprouting warnings of doom and damnation, as though we can't all see the rift, awake or asleep, as though we're not all thinking that the end might very well be bloody nigh. But what does it help, stirring people up like that, attacking them? I'll tell you, it didn't help. The pilgrim whose wick burned down with them so bad, he drew a blade to warn them off. Protecting his family, it later turned out, but that don't carry no weight with the enforcers, and it don't carry no weight with us. Naked blades aren't allowed anywhere through the docks without a permit. He'd been past enough commandment placards to bloody well know it. So that was it. Had to shoot him. Did the deed myself. The only pity is that the first luminary Janus wouldn't let us put a few rounds into the cultists for disturbing the Emperor's peace, too. Uh, might have made an example. Settled them down. But I'll just have to make my own peace with that, eh? Report ends. Entry date. Talada Standard 994623, Cycle 1. Location. Satrapol Orbital Dockyards, Corminus Ward. Report Lock. 8472. Reporting Officer. Luminary Second Class Leandra Pace. 86 Grask Illuminators. Report commences. Six more ships. Six. We're spread thin, the enforcers thinner, and the tithe masters thinnest of all. Of course, that just slows things down even more, breeds unrest, leaves gaps for trouble to slip through. The idle are wicked, and the wicked never idle, as they say. Hmm, <laughs> that would make us the most wicked of the lot, I think, with that busy. Uh, I take stims to keep functioning, I hit a bottle of shock to get off to sleep at shift's end, there's a few enough hours of that before it all begins again. What I'd give for a proper rest rotation, but no sign of that any time soon. And with that, off for a few hours' blessed oblivion. Report ends. Entry date, Talada Standard, 9946-03 Cycle 9. Location, Satrapol Orbital Dockyards, Corminus Ward. Report log, 8474. Reporting officer. Memory second class, Leandra Pace, 86 Gradesk, Illuminators. Report commences. Emperor's bones, this has not been a good rotation. 
The compress wrapped around my arm tells my tale all by itself, and I'll be honest, I'm angry. It was the damned cults again, the Emperor's mercy I expect this from, but at this time they dragged the Church of the Radiant Hope into it. Or at least, both were involved. By the time we reached the Penitent's Hall, it was bedlam. We got right into it. Shotguns and flamers were discharged. I took a bullet to the meat of my right arm before it all got calmed down again. Thrown, but the enforcers have got a lot of arrests to process after that one. Far as we could make out, it began with the Emperor's Mercy preaching the bile and brimstone at the pilgrims again. Then the Radiant Hope arrive and start their own sermon, completely different message to the Emperor's Mercy, though with no less doom and gloom. Sounds as though the cultists lost patience with one another. Blades were drawn, things thrown, firearms were discharged, and it got much more serious very quickly. People ran for cover, others got involved, out and out fighting on our docks under our very noses. Don't care who grieved who or why, I'll say that much. Illuminators were injured. Enforcers, too. No one's in the right once that happens. No one but us. I'll be watching the cults carefully from now on. Mark me on that. Report ends. Entry date, Tarita Standard, 99471, 05 Cycle 1. Location, Satrapal Orbital Dockyards, Colmenus Ward. Report, 8477. Reporting Officer, Illuminary Second Class Leandra Pace, 86 Grenist Illuminators. Report commences. Emperor's Mercy and the Radiant Hope got into it again. This time in the Mendicat's Shrine on Deck 418. Bastards, the lot of them. There's one Imperial Faith, one Creed, not dozens. The Emperor's word isn't open to intrapladitation. Should all be purged. My arm is still bloody sore as well. Still, these trials are sent to teach us the value of suffering, as they say. Report ends. Entry date, Talaga Standard, 9948305, cycle 5. Location, Stratford Bowl, Lord to Dr. Hominus Ward. Report, Lord E491. Reporting Officer, Memory Second, Place, 86 Eliminators. Report commences. I feel that there's a storm in the air. It's like the tightness that settles over the tundra right before the maelstroms break open above the hawkeries. Thrown, I miss Grenisk sometimes. The open spaces, the hunts. At least those are simple, straightforward. The blooding at the end and the surety of a simple dawn the next day. May as well wish for the thedrite chaste case of an Amasek, eh? Wishes of the heretic's promise. In short, the pilgrims are unsettled, and it's making everyone's jobs harder. They're obstinate, wary, suspicious, and we're suspicious of them. There's been arrests, far more than normal, even with all these ships. Odd sigils, daubed in throne alone, knows what, on the walls of back corridors and servo oubliettes. Fights breaking out all over, heretical proclamations pinned to bulkheads. This can't carry on. I know that much, we all do, but what's to be done about it? Of that I've got no notion. Punitive executions, maybe? A purge? The Emperor will guide us in this, as he does in all things, I'm sure. Report ends. Report I'm acting with the Emperor's own sanction whilst these cult fanatics are just wearing his holiness like a damn disguise, hiding it behind a shield. Yes, you're bloody right I shot that heretic. I don't care one thrown damned wit if he was armed or not. Purge them all for the unrest they're spreading. The righteous reap their reward beyond the veil. That's the saying. Well, if they're so damned righteous, let them go and claim their prize and be done with it, eh? Drinking too much. I know I am, but nothing else will take the edge off. Arm still hurts, peeling with an ugly scar. Tomorrow will be better. <laughs> Aye, sure. Report ends. Standard. Cycle 9. Location. Cetropo Orbital Dockyards, Colmanus Ward. Report log 8499. 
reporting officer, luminary second class Leon Pace, eight. <sighs> Report commences. Crowd crushed today. Massed panic in Penitence Hall, nominous. Dozens killed, hundreds more injured. We had to close the bulkheads and let it wear itself out, or they'll have stampeded the hall's octus and decimal, and that would have meant a lot more dead. Pulled the lever myself, thrown help me, there was satisfaction in that, seeing their bone vine faces turn to shock and terror. Yes, that's right, you vapid idiots. Reap the wages of your own stupidity. The heretic's reward is to be crushed by the merciless gear of his own unclean artifice. As they say. Part of me is afraid I should feel something for consigning them all to death like that. Part of me doesn't feel anything at all. Mostly I'm just angry. Just angry. They said afterwards it was hallucination that started it. Some mass vision. Manifestation. Throne knows what started the panic. Report ends. Entry. No. Location. Central go on. Absolutely cannot. Either we outlaw false creeds throughout the docks, or it'll end in blood. I'll say that. I almost hope it does. The Emperor's mercy and the radiant hope are as good at war already. Skirmishes through the duck works and maintenance decks. The cults sending processions through the penitent's hall, demanding the pilgrims choose between one creed and another. As if they both weren't treading the high wire over heresy and damnation their own damn selves. We break it up where we can, and the enforcers have doubled their guards around the Tithe Masters, but tch, throw a nose. Report ends. Halliday Standard 9952030779. Location such a. Ward. Report log. 8511. Reporting officer, Luminator. Pace, 86. Luminators. Report begins. Um. Mrs. I don't want to hurt anyone. You know that, don't you, Emperor? You hear my truth. I only do my duty. Bloody hell, too much to drink again. These damn dreams. I don't want to hurt anyone. Not really. They just make me so... Angry. Maybe want to do things. I'm loyal. You hear me? I'm loyal to the Emperor. And it, faith it just makes me want to... Just anger. But these bloody heretics, never mind. Erasing this one. Erasing. Erasing. Oh, throne. Saints bones to it. Intradate. Tanada Standard 995206. 08 Cycle 3. Location. Cetropole Orbital Dockyard's Corminus Ward. Report Log 8517. Reporting Log Luminary 2nd Class Leandro Pace, 86th Grotesque Illuminators. Report commences. It has gone too far. We shan't stand back and allow heresy to flourish any longer. There has been a riot spread like wildfire through the pilgrims, and it's still being stamped out by our soldiers and the enforcers both. We see it now. Informants came to us, backed up by the findings of the enforcers. I am angry, for we have been blind. The cult of the Emperor's mercy. How did we not see them for what they were all the sooner? They started the riot, decrying the radiant hope as heretics, demanding the people's aid in purging their rivals. Anger and fear begat violence as they knew it would, and by time the storm had died back. However, many hours later, hundreds were dead. Pilgrims, cultists, enforcers. Only it wasn't the Holy Crusade it claimed, was it? How could it been? When we found eight of our own butchered in some kind of rune-etched ritual circle, their bodies dragged from their posts and deposited in the docks cathedrium primus. That must have been the work of the Emperor's mercy. They used the pilgrims' weak faith as a cover to work their own nefarious evils, their own murder. Well, they'll find soon enough that our fury knows no bounds, and the Emperor has no mercy for them, no matter their name. I depart now. The purge commences. Report ends. End.
Frankfurt Gate. The moment of rapture. The vision, the holy heavens, praise the Emperor of Crimson White. Report log 888. Reporting officer, enlightened, and then young drop pace, Bradask illuminated. Praise be ye to the Emperor, for we are delivered at last, whilst the curt of the Emperor's mercy are no more. Days it took us to purge them, days after they got news of our onset, and fled to the maintenance decks. Had it not been for the aid of the radiant light, we may never have cornered and butchered our quarry as we did. Oh, blood flowed on both sides, but then it is as the preachers of the radiant light say, all bloodshed pleases the Emperor, for it is all holy, no matter whence it flows. How did it take me so long to see? I thank the Emperor from the bottom of my heart that we heard the message of the radiant light as the blood flowed, and holy battle was joined. I am shamed that for so long I believed them to be no better than the vermin of the Emperor's mercy, but I am enlightened now. They who prate of mercy, of forbearance, of temperance, they are heretics. This is not an age of merciful deeds, but for war, an ending in the Emperor's name. He sits upon the golden throne, atop a mountain of heretic skulls, and he sees our deeds. He bellows his endless call to war. Oh, and there can be reward for those of true faith. I see it now, and I am not alone. We shall spread this message through the ranks. Throne, you can be sure of that. We may be the first to join the radiant light, but we shan't be the last, and any who oppose us. Well, the Emperor cries out from holy terror, not for peace, but for battle unending. We'll give him that. Report ends. <laughs>